This ovule has been fertilized and will become a seed. Each of its cells contains one or more sets of chromosomes, but the number of sets of chromosomes differs among the parts of the ovule. Double fertilization converts the large central cell from diploid to triploid, while the egg becomes a diploid zygote. The surrounding integuments remain diploid as they were before fertilization. The embryo is a young plant that grows from the zygote, while the large central cell grows into food-storing endosperm. All this is enclosed within a protective seed coat that grows from the integuments around the ovule. Taking food through its stalk, the developing seed expands its endosperm and embryo. When the embryo is mature and dormant, the integuments develop into a protective seed coat and detach from the ovary wall. The main axis of the embryo has a root apex and a short stem that may have a few tiny leaves, not shown here, near the shoot apex. The cotyledons are part of the embryo. They're the first leaves. Monocots have one cotyledon. Eudicots have two.